Is there a way to stretch it? No, no. Okay, let's keep full screen. Despite them thinking they were ready, it's always different when people are hammering it. There's always little things that you don't expect when there's you're expecting a shit ton of people to hit a service. Always. Also, yeah, why does it say 1987? <laughs> what the fuck? The thing is, I don't think this is stretched, because there's, there's still black above, there's still black down below, and there's still black on the edges. Like, right here? I can't get to the other side, but... Anyways... Let's do this. Oh my god, except his circle. What is happening? Okay, we're gonna go on normal. Why is circle except? What? I'm so hyped! There was voice acting in this, right? In the first one? That water sound, though. Stay in that. Yeah, wait a second. I know it. I'm going to swap down a couple of bombers and flies. This looks really hard to look at. Oh my god. Oh, that makes sense, Fedo. So I This is Snake. Colonel, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What's the situation, Snake? So let's not talk about any of the story for any of these because I still have no idea. Like I don't know what the fuck liquid is, but skin shut the fuck up. I don't know anything about this game. But make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. When you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to contact you, the codec will beep. When you hear that noise, press the select button. Nice. The codec's receiver directly stimulates the small bones of your ear. No one but you will be able to hear it. Nice. Got it. Okay, I'm ready to go. Oh, it uses the D-pad. Oh, 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 oh. oh, I don't know what to do. Oh, I forgot circle was no. Oh, I forgot, okay. Uh oh, I heard. Uh... So what you're saying is to do this. The thing is, I don't know if full screen's actually stretching it. Oh yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it was. Okay, yep, let's go ahead and, uh... How much space? Actually, let me unpause it so we can see how much space we have here. Let's chunk that off and let's move it all over here. It's gonna look really weird if I hit the PlayStation button, though. Oh, no. Not, not really. That's a pretty crazy darkness over there. Oh well, whatever. Alright, so this is clearly gonna be a fucking really great time. Okay, so... I'm so excited. So how badly do you guys think I'm gonna complain about the controls for this? I'm gonna try my best to deal with it. <laughs> oh shit. What if I can set it to use the analog stick? Oh yeah, if 
Fire function. Is that gonna work? You think? Oh yeah, analog stick. Sweet, so you can use both now. So how do I? What's the use button? Hold on, I'm about to be seen. Yeah, I don't know if I want to use the analog stick. It's actually a little bit harder to use. How do you? What's the? What's the? Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh, I have to wait. I just want to point out, you guys, this is running at a pretty bad frame rate, but I'll have to deal with it because PlayStation One. Oh shit, that's really loud. Hide on the wall. Could it make it a bit louder? Of course I can. There we go. Don't let me know if that's loud enough. Snake's getting naked. No, I don't think I'll do a no alert playthrough. I don't think that's gonna happen. <gasps> There's vibrate! Ooh, I'm excited. All the inevitable alerts at full volume. <laughs> no, fed up. <laughs> Try this thing really quick, you guys. It's Snake. I'm in front of the disposal facility. Excellent, Snake. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. How's that sneaking suit working out? I'm nice and dry, but it's a little hard to move. Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. This is Alaska, you know. Take it easy. I'm grateful. If it weren't for your suit and your shot, I would have turned into a popsicle out there. An anti-freezing peptide, Snake. All of the genome soldiers in this exercise are using it. I see. I'm relieved to hear that. Already tested, huh? By the way, how's the diversionary operation going? Two F-16s just took off from Galena and are headed your way. The terrorist radar should have already picked them up. I wonder if there's a way for me to... Behind D. Colonel. Behind D. What's a Russian gunship doing here? I have no idea, but it looks like our little diversion got their attention. Now's your best chance to slip in unnoticed. I was wondering if I could put like a blocky effect on my face, but I don't think I can do it. The controller is vibrating so fucking much. There's so much blue dead space on the right here, like it's insane. There are only 18 hours left until their deadline. You've got to hurry. Wow, he must be crazy to fly behind in this kind of weather. Who's that? Oh, sorry. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. She designed your codec, as well as your Soliton radar system. Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. <laughs> nice to meet you, Snake. It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. What's wrong? Just nothing. 
I just didn't expect a world-class designer of military technology to be so cute. Oh. <laughs> You're just flattering me. No, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. Come on. I can't believe I'm being hit on by the famous Solid Snake. But uh, I'm surprised. You're very frank for a trained killer. Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Yeah. I'm looking forward to learning about the man behind the legend. But first, let me explain about your Solitan radar system. The bright dot in the middle is you, Snake. The red dots are your enemies, and the blue cone shape represents their field of vision. Be careful, Snake. The genome soldiers have highly developed senses of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Make sure you don't let them see you. First, I want you to infiltrate the disposal site and look for the DARPA chief. The DARPA chief was injected with the same GPS transmitting nanomachines as you. Okay. He should appear on your radar as a green dot. Get whatever information you can from him about the terrorists. If he's alive, that is. Snake, your radar isn't affected by the weather, but if you're discovered by an enemy, you won't be able to use it. Yes, it gets jammed easily, I'm afraid. Yes, it's all made from currently existing technology. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. We'll be monitoring your movements by radar, so contact us by codec anytime you want. Got it. I'll call if I'm feeling lonely. Seriously, Snake, we're here to back you up, so call if you need some information or advice. I'm also in charge of your mission data. Contact me if you want me to record your current status. My frequency is 140.96. So she's for saving. It's okay. a dedicated frequency for saving data. Don't forget it. Wait, what was it? 14096? Except for your binoculars, you're naked. You need to arm yourself with whatever weapons you can find. I remember. First, I'm strip-searched by Dr. Naomi here, and then all my weapons are taken away. Imagine yourself put in that position. Well, if you make it back in one piece, maybe I'll let you do a strip-search on me. Oh, no, shit. I'll hold you to that, Doctor. By the way, sorry to disappoint you, but I did manage to smuggle out my smokes. How did you do that? In my stomach. Thanks to the shot you gave me that suppressed my stomach acids. Cigarettes? How are those going to help you? You never know. If you want to get in, there's the front door. It's the fastest way, but there's too much risk of being spotted by the enemy. Hmm. I can't just knock on the door and ask them to let me in. Uh, there's one sentry on the left and one on the right. They're armed with five five sixers and pineapples. Awesome. So now we're going that way. We're not going that way. There you go, Drago. What about the air duct near the door? There should also be a duct on the second floor. So you're telling me that in Metal Gear Solid 1, there are multiple entrances. This game had multiple ways to do things. I'll let you decide the best COA. I'm counting on you, Snake. I don't know how to do that skin. Actually, let's see if I can put a hotkey on it. Actually, first one I want to see is that there's actually black bars above and below this. So if we can, uh, say do that, do that, do that. We can just make this. Right about there. It looks really weirdly placed, doesn't it? I feel like. Eh. Maybe we'll just re add those. Yeah, it's not so bad. Uh, I don't know if we can put a hotkey for that. Uh, no. No, can't put a hot key. No, it's been something I've been wanting to do for like a month or something. Or more than that, I think. Alright. 
If you guys want me to change it so that everything is black instead of having the blue on the side or all that stuff, uh, let me know. But, uh, yeah. Do you guys think you can actually get that, uh, item? I'm trying to use the right stick to fucking change the camera. This isn't working. Oh, God. So can I, can I climb over stuff? Is that a thing that Snake can do? He can punch. Okay, so pushing forward towards something. Oh shit. Soka? Is that a gun? Oh, it's a pistol. I don't want that. A surveillance camera? Wasn't there stairs over here? Weren't there? Oh shit. Who's that? No! <laughs> Get inside! <laughs> We did it. <laughs> it's just legs. It's like, oh fuck, we we lost them. We lost the agent. Maybe it was taken by you, Fedo. Okay, well somehow we survived that. Well, that's a little bit brighter. I can actually move forward. Okay. Snake, this is McDonald Miller. It's been a long time. Master, what are you doing here? I quit being a drill instructor, so I moved out here for some peace and quiet. I'm in retirement, just like you. Once in a while, I still help train the Alaskan scouts. Passing on the skills to a new generation, huh? <laughs> Campbell told me about the situation here. I thought I might be of some use. There's no one I'd rather have in a foxhole than you. Well, I know lots about survival in a harsh environment. I've lived in Alaska longer than you. So call me if you have any questions about the flora or fauna out here. My frequency is 141.80. I still can't even try to get my name, Mephetto. Alright, so 141.80. Alright. What's up, Street F? Street F91? I don't know if I should be taking a ration right now or not. It's so dark. Is it supposed to be this dark? 141.80. Okay. If I hit this and go down to memory. Okay, it saves it anyway. Huh? I moved the dark machine to the cell in the first floor basement. What about the vent shaft cleaning? They just opened the vent covers. Flip through, by the way. About to start spraying for rats. First floor basement ventilation shaft. Shut those covers as soon as they're done spraying. Also, keep your eye on that woman in the cell. Don't get careless now. Woman in the cell? Yeah, what chick? Did something happen? All right, There's an intruder. Really? He's already done three people. He's killed three people? What? No, yeah. you haven't. They say he's using stealth, too. Stealth? There's an intruder besides me? Oh. Anyway, I want you to increase the security detail on the chief. It's gonna be super rad, you guys. Didn't Metal Gear Solid 1 get a, a remake on the GameCube or something? It was like Twin Snakes or something weird? You said thank you to him. There's an item. There's also a hole.
Was that version any good? Press the action button to drop down. Press the action button to drop down. Yeah, but I don't want that bounce. Ration. You're able to get in as well, Trackle? Alright, give me a second. I'm gonna go try to just reserve that name for Wildstar. Sorry, everybody. I just wanna make sure that I get that stuff. What's up, Bradis? How you doing, buddy? No, I still can't. Oh, no, it's asking me for my login now. Any luck on the login? Service temporarily unavailable. Nope, still can't do it. Action button. Fan base hates it. Wow. Why? Any reason why? Or, um. What? So when I put my controller down, it just starts going crazy. Use the elevator to change floors. There should be a cargo elevator that you can take down somewhere around there. Try to find it. I don't know if I. If I, know, if I try to claim mine and. Oops. God damn it, stupid circle being not fucking. Um. If, uh. Sweet. Oh, chop grenade. Uh, if, if, if Richo is taken, then you know that probably yours got saved, because then mine is. Call 14152? What is that? If it's anything spoilery, don't. Please, please don't. Ah! The camera's looking. Please don't tell me. Yeah, it seems like a horrible idea. Let's not. Uh. So rations heal my health up, right? They don't do any other weird shit. Uh. Nope. Okay. How do you use things? Okay. Alright, so we have to go downwards. So you have one dude patrolling right there. One dude patrolling right there. He's going... Where's this guy going? Is he gonna keep going upwards? Can I hop over? Is, is this too next level for this game? Okay. Have any equipped or auto use? Wait, can I still like? Okay, I can't quick unequip. Oh, you can. So is there actually something I can do up here then? Oh, that wasn't where that... Thermal goggles. Okay, maybe it was. So is there some sort of checkpoint system or should I have already saved by now? Actually, no, I gotta go all the way around because the stairs are on the other side. Just because I want to make sure... Oh, no, I can fall down here, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, just so I know how old school this game is, does it have some form of checkpoint? Or, or do I have to just rely on me saving constantly? Just, just to know. Alright, let's do a quick save then. It's going to take me... Forever. No, I should be quick saving in case I die. Is, is my with this nanomachine transmitter, he should show up as a green, yeah, a green dot. dot. 
Green dot. Try find him. Save. Mission new zone saves. Okay. Memory card one. Yeah. Come on, Snake. You can do it. She believes in me. No one ever believes in me. Not even you guys. Go down the stairs. Go down the stairs. Is he gonna turn around? I'm not sure I know where I'm supposed to go. Oh, what's this? Nope, that's nothing else weird. That I didn't like this? What is that? Epic Sick Nasty 720 Kicks Quick Scope Kill and. Was that? <laughs> so I don't get to see any of that craziness, whatever the fuck happened? If you die and continue, you'll rebegin at the room you died in. Okay, awesome. Thank you, Radis. Alright, thanks everyone. You guys have been really awesome for this. Okay, so there's a dude coming up top. That was really close, I think. Oh, what was that vent? Did I have a vent? That doesn't have a vent. I think we're doing okay so far. It's so weird using the d-pad for this. Although, also, if you guys have any ideas for what I should be putting in the background around me, I'm not used to casting a 4x3 game. Uh, so if you guys have either some cool background art or something I can put, let me know. I can totally replace it. Um, yeah. Oh. Oh, is this good? That's probably not good. Oh. Is this going upwards? Okay, no panic. How is there, how is there water in there? I guess all the snow melted? I don't know what a love box is. Uh, no, I don't think I need help. I wouldn't, I wouldn't point me in the right direction too, too much. I'll kind of want to just smash my face into this game. What's up, Booty Hunter? How you doing, buddy? Welcome. Okay, we got another ration, so let's go ahead and use this one. Let's pick that one up, okay. So all that was for nothing, really. Kinda. Just a cover box? Okay. Um, yeah, if you guys want me to put anything behind me, I'm not, like I said, I'm not used to having some tons of white space there, so if you guys have anything cool you guys want me to put, let me know. I'll throw it up there. Just find something that is at least 1920 by 720. Sorry. 1980 by 720. 1080p can work as well. I can totally shrink it down. But anything lower than that is going to look all stretched and fucked up on the background. So. Uh, if you die in a room, anything you got will be gone. Basically, it'll reset. So if it's gone, but I can go and reacquire it, I guess. Also, what's up, Super Sack Cooper? Jimmy Snake. Ooh, that's really cool. If you swap room when you co-op, you can have two people in one box, hence a love box. Oh, that's really cool. Alright, so that was all for a ration. I think. Put that somewhere. Dude, I look so young in that picture, too. Alright, so I guess we weren't supposed to come here. I don't know where that dude's patrolling right now, though. Okay, we're okay. I don't understand how to use doors, though. Oh, that guy's coming. Oh, that guy's coming. Oh, that other guy's coming. Uh, 
Can they see through this? They can't see through that, can they? See you, Elite. Take care, man. I'm about a snake bandana with tomorrow. Can I make it behind that guy? I'm too afraid. I'm too. Ah, let's go for it. There's nothing else here. Oh shit! Oh, that's not the right button. Alright, so there's only one thing. They'll never find me. Okay. So is the what what's the button for using doors? Is there is there like a circle. What? Oh! oh! Okay, I thought there was going to be somebody in there. Oh, what is this? This is an elevator. Is it an elevator? Oh god. Don't look in here. B1? Yes, this is the beginning of the game, for sure. Let's run into them? Okay. So that in this game, in the sequel, apparently you could run behind a guard except for some exceptions, so yeah. Over. Nice! Perfect. I like the... I like the RP as well. I like it. This is gonna be a good time to cast. Look at the radar. It's picking up the DARPA chief. He's the green dot. Hurry and rescue him! <laughs> Damn, that's awesome. <laughs> I'm saving that. So we found the DARPA chief. So how how long for, for for okay? How long do you think it takes to beat this game for somebody who's never really played it before, who doesn't know where he's going, and has never really played a Metal Gear Solid game except for four and like a little bit of three and a little bit of two? AKA somebody who doesn't really know the controls, running through this game, touching everything, trying to do stuff. How long do you think it would take? Snake, if you want to go up or down a ladder, just press the action button by the ladder. Perfect. Run eight hours? Oh, okay, cool. Normal maybe ten hours? Okay, eight, ten hours. All right, I like it. Hopefully you guys are okay with watching somebody who's never played this stuff before kind of bumble around a little bit. So, all right, 12 hours, all right, we're going up. Twice? Oh man. So hopefully you guys, for those of you who've played this before, hopefully you're okay with watching me kind of maybe be the worst salt snake ever. Even Ground Zero? I'm hoping that by the time I finish all of these, if you guys are cool with me watch, uh, playing these, or cool with watching me play these, um, we can pick up Ground Zero so we can go through that as well. So, hopefully. 20 hours for me, you son of a bitch. Snake, the DARPA chief signal is coming from somewhere in that area. Isn't there some place to drop down? Take a look around in first-person view mode. That's not what I want to do. Shut up. The button in this circle is not back out. Infinity and have an eternity? Alright, thanks, you too. I'm here to save you. 
You're the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, right? You're here to save me, huh? What's your outfit? I'm the pawn they sent here to save your worthless butt. Really? It's true. You don't look like one of them. It's George Bird, the uh, beard bard. Hurry up and get me out of here. Slow down. What's up, Don't guy? worry. First, I want some information about the terrorists. Is George Baird his terrorists? code name? They or really is that his voice actor? Launch a nuke. What are you talking about? The terrorists are threatening the White House. They say if they don't accede to their demands, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. Sweet Jesus. Is it possible? It's possible. They could launch a nuke. <sighs> How did they plan to launch? I thought this place was just for keeping the dismantled warheads. They shouldn't have access to a missile. What I'm about to tell you is classified information. Okay? Oh, the voice actor? We're okay. conducting exercises with a new type of experimental weapon. A weapon that will change the world. What? A weapon with the ability to launch a nuclear attack from any place on the face of the Earth. Oh, dear. A nuclear-equipped walking battle tank. Metal Gear? Say it? Is that what he's gonna say? Is he gonna say it? Hope he says it. Metal Gear. Yeah! Kudos go. I'm so excited. You knew? Metal Gear is one of the most secret black projects. How did you know that? We've had a couple of run-ins in the past. So that's the reason you were here at this disposal site? Why else would I come to a godforsaken place like this? I had heard the Metal Gear project was scrapped. On the contrary, it's grown into a huge joint project between arms tech and ourselves. We were going to use this exercise as raw data and then proceed to mass production. If it hadn't been for the revolution. Revolution? Rex has fallen into the hands of terrorists. Rex. Metal Gear Rex. The code name the for dinosaur. the Metal Gear prototype. That's the dinosaur sound. They're probably already this bitch is like, what? The warhead they plan to use what is he, a schizo? What's happening? These guys are pros. They're all experienced in handling and equipping weapons. Hey! Shut up in there, will ya? But I thought that all nuclear warheads were equipped with safety measures. Some kind of detonation code that you have to input. Oh, you mean PAL? Yes, of course, there is a PAL. It's set up so that you need to input two different passwords in order to launch the device. There are two passwords? Yes, Baker knows one, and I know one. Baker? The president of arms tech? That's right. Each of us needs to input our password, or there can be no launch. But they found out my password. No. You talked. Psychomantis can read people's minds. You can't resist. Psychomantis. One of the members of Foxhound. He has psychic powers. Pew, pew. This is bad. It's just a matter of time before they get Baker's too. She is so hot right now. If they find out Baker's password... Yes, they'll be able to launch a nuke anytime. But there is a way to stop the launch. What? The card keys. Card keys? They were designed by Armstead, the system developers, as an emergency override. Even without the passwords, you can just insert the card keys and engage the safety lock. And if I do that? Yes. You can stop the launch. That card key? So where are the keys? Baker should have them. Listen, you need three card keys. There are three different slots to put them in. You need to insert a card into each one of them. Okay, three card keys. Do you know Never actually owned a PlayStation 1 Baker? or PS2, low drag. Somewhere in the second floor basement. 
Second floor basement. I heard the guards say they moved him to an area that has a lot of electronic jamming. Any other clues? Yes. They cemented over the entrances, but didn't have enough time to paint them. Why don't you look for the areas where the walls are a different color? Here, take this. It's my ID card. It'll open any level one security door. It's called a pan card. It works together with your body's own electrical field. Personal area network, huh? It transmits data using the salts in your body as the transmission medium. As you approach the door's security devices, they'll read the data stored in the card. And the doors will open automatically. Gotcha. Okay, I'm gonna get you out of here. Wait a minute. What is it? You haven't heard any other way to disarm the pal, have you? From your bosses or anyone? No. Are you sure you haven't heard anything? I just said no. So does the White House plan to give in to the terrorists' demands? That's their problem. It has nothing to do with my orders. But what about the Pentagon? Pentagon? Uh, is it <gasps> what is it? A zombie? Oh, he's dying. Absolutely not. Snake, you've got to understand. This op is security level red. You need the highest security clearance to get access to the complete file. You want me to believe that you're in charge of this op, but you don't have complete access to the file? I told you. The Secretary of Defense is in operational control. I'm just here as your support. Snake, we don't have time to debate. Get out of there and find President Baker. So they have the president too, huh? What? Wait, the dot. How'd that guard not see someone die? Don't move! Oh. So you killed the chief, you bastard! Liquid? No, you're not. Don't move! Is this the first time you ever pointed a gun at a person? Your hands are shaking. <sighs> Can you shoot me, rookie? Careful. I'm no rookie. Liar. That nervous glance. That scared look in your eyes. They're rookie's eyes if I ever saw them. I can't even You've see your eyes. shot a person, am I right? You talk too much. You haven't even taken the safety off, rookie. I told you I'm no rookie! <sighs> You're not one of them, are you? Open that door. You've got a card, don't you? Why? So we can get the hell out of here! Looks like we'll be a little delayed. Oh no! What are you doing? Don't think! Shoot! I got you, bitches! I do it just for kicks! Can I shoot? How do you shoot? How do you shoot? I was actually trying to figure out how to shoot. <laughs> I'm guessing circle doesn't activate doesn't activate the, the weapon that you have. Uh, uh, uh. 
Drop a chief's down, we're missing one bullet out of our clip. What happened? So is it... Okay, it's square. What's going on with her? What are you waiting for? Shoot! Don't talk to me like a rookie! I'm telling you, shoot! Remember is turning it on and off from Ooh! Unclipping and unequipping your weapon from like two did something. Oh my god. What's up, Trace? Whew. I feel like you don't have Thanks for the help. <laughs> I don't know, super sad. Wait! Who are you? That was quite the ass rocking. You fool! You've killed him! I'm sorry, sir. His mental shielding was very strong. I could not dive into his mind. Now we'll never get that detonation code. Boss, I have a good idea. She's still missing, like Good girl. Just like that. What? I just had some kind of hallucination. Is it from the nanomachines? No, Snake. The nanomachines are functioning properly. So what was it? It must have been psychometric interference coming from Psychomantis, Foxhound Psychic. Think of it as a mental feedback loop. So that was Mantis. Wow. Get some water in me. Pouring water. Hmm. Oh, now, Hardy. There are other words you can use, friend. Yep, no, you solid one. Excited. Really am. This game is so far really awesome, despite being old. What? Is that a trap? Can't hide in lockers. I 
Because we're not supposed to come this way? What's up, Chris? Shall wait then. So you're saying that was le that wasn't level two? No, it's B two. I guess let's go back up. Or hold on. Was there somewhere else we could have went in B one? Closed it. Call the colonel. Snake, Psycho Mantis has the power to read people's minds. He got the DARPA chief's detonation code. Hurry up or he'll get Baker's code too. That's right. If the terrorists get Baker's code, hmm. they'll be able to launch that nuke anytime they want. Yeah, they'll use Metal Gear to do it. Colonel, did you know they were conducting a military exercise here using Metal Gear? I didn't know. Really? Snake, you've got to understand. I'm just the middleman in this operation. Anyway, hurry up and get to the second floor basement. You've got to save the arms tech president before the terrorists find out his code. So we have to get to B2. Okay. Maybe I missed something down there? This music's badass as shit, though. So how's it going, Chris? Do I have to equip the card? Aha! Okay. Okay. Must be this one? Was there an entrance or an exit? Oh, thanks, Hardia. I didn't know you unfollowed. So found bullets. It's okay, Ardia. Okay. So Hmm. 
I'm supposed to look for a differently colored wall or something, aren't I? Is it going to be super obvious? Is that over there? That's a ghost kid. Oh no, that was just that. Hmm. Okay, so I just. Is it one of the outer walls? Oh, is it that one? No. Is it one of the outer walls or is it to break into a room? That's all I'm kind of curious about. That looks different colored. Does that look different colored, or is that... No, that's just the light. Okay. It's the outer wall? Okay. Oh, it's not one to do. Oh. How do you... Oh. Did it. Sweet! Jamming. I found another one. Can't you believe in the 60s? Nice. Oh, oh, oh! Oh! Spider-Man? He's alive. You're the arms tech president, Kenneth Baker, right? Don't worry. I'm here to save you. No. No, don't touch it! C4. Special Operations Foxhound. Revolver Ocelot. Hmm. 
I've been waiting for you, Solid Snake. Now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. This is the greatest handgun ever made. The Colt Single Action Army. Oh god, he's having a seizure. Bullets, more than enough to kill anything that moves. Now I'll show you why they call me... Revolver. So Steven Taylor? Draw! No, no, no. Uh-oh. Hiding won't help you. I understand the bullets you see. I make them go where I want. Oh, no way he fucking ricochets him? I love to reload during a battle. There's nothing like a human slamming a long silver bullet into a well rich chamber. All right, alive. Let's go. You better hurry up. The old man's not gonna let us. Don't you want to settle this? Damn it. Dog. Oh, damn it, not me. Damn it! Come on, you bitch. Ah. Why is it so hard to aim at him? Oh god, wrong button. Wait a minute. 
Oh wow, really? Oh wow. Um. I don't think I'm gonna survive this, you guys. I know, so much groaning. What's up, success, success kid? What's up, MCP? What's up, G-Man the King? Oh, we have to redo this? Yeah, let's just bomb it. Black discipline. Alright, we watched this cutscene already. Let's do this. Hiding won't help you. Oops. Damn it. Damn it. I love the reload and turning it back. There's nothing like it. It's following G-Man the King. Alright. I'm alive. Let's go. Ah, oh, I can't ever aim properly once these. I don't want to accidentally pick up those bullets. Actually, he's first person in this one. Smell of your own death. No, I can't. Oh god, I can't do it in this one. Damn it. What's up, Fahrenheit? Come on, take a shot at me. Oh, you bastard. Oh, you dirty rat. Yeah, you're dead. You're pretty good. Just what I'd expect from the man with the same code as the boss. It's been a long time since I had such a good fight. But I'm just getting warmed up. What? My what? Hand. Up his hand with the gun. Who are you? I like you. I have no name. That that X 
exoskeleton. From the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psychomatis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Kind of like a psychic insulation. Everyone who knows these top secret codes has it. Even the DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah, I'm sure. In that case, how did they get your code? I never had any training on how to resist torture. <coughs> it looks like he had some fun with you, all right. Oh, he's not human. I can tell you he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? Someone you broke it. Looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. Ha. Huh. You're a funny man. So the DARPA chief, is he okay? Dead. What? I can't be. No, no, that's not what you promised, Jim. Now you want to shut me up? Oh. <laughs> Calm down. What's wrong with you? I just told you I was here to save you. Uh, I didn't kill the DARPA chief. He had a heart attack or something. A heart attack? Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Those boys are totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate to launch. I agree. But what do they really want? Oh, who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry. Always looking forward to the next good war. Well, I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have the card keys? Card keys? To override the detonation code. I heard you had them. No, not anymore. What? Who does then? Not the terrorists. No, that woman. Woman? Who? A soldier that was thrown in prison along with me. A female soldier, it must be. She said she had just joined up as a new recruit. They threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion. A new recruit? Could that be the colonel's niece? I gave her the key. Looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by <laughs> Kodak. Until I was Wait, tied was up this on Dreamcast like as well? Oh, Kodak. Least, was it? Yes, she stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. I'm sure she still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you, it's... Oh, sorry, I forgot. Damn! Oh, that's right. It should be on the back of the CD case. Try to contact her. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? That's what you guys are talking about? You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Who's that? The team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A genius in engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the nuclear warhead storage building. It's north from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. Wait, what year is this set in? It's ever been. The amount of spent nuclear fuel and plutonium is increasing even today. Listen, have you ever seen a warehouse full of nuclear material? No. Drums and drums of nuclear waste stacked this high, as far as you can see. 
Because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good Doesn't job five? of wow. storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Not only that, but several pounds of muff are reported every year. Pounds of muff. It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. In other words, there's plenty of available nuclear material and scientists for making a bomb. We live in an age when any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? Uh, Russia and China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. You mean Metal Gear. Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace. I remember hearing a lot I didn't about realize the first one also had to take over the weapons kind of awesome. makers. Yes. And after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, so it's a month. the Metal Gear system was our last and ace have... in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black Racism. project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time on your weapons production. And no one can bother you. Not even those bleeding heart liberals on the Military Oversight Committee. Okay, cool. Bribes. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise. Oh, were did analyzed. he? I totally zoned out when I made I don't my give a crap about you and your company. <laughs> yes, my that's bad. what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, this is what you came for, right? What's that? An optical disc. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. They don't know this disc exists. Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. Is his name Jim Campbell? I'll give you my card too. It'll open up all security level two doors. Can you walk? Alright, for No. No, you go on without me. They got my password. They don't want anything else from me. I have one more really? question. Really? Oh, cool. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret? An experimental genome soldier. <coughs> you know him? No. Oh. You should ask Dr. Oh Dale yeah, Jim was Darper guy. Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi. You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are finished. What? How do you run in Metal Gear use currently existing technology? Metal Gear itself does, but... Oh no, he's on toes! What did you do to me? Oh no, oh, oh no, it can't be. Those Pentagon bastards! So, they, they actually went and did it! What are you talking about? They, they, they're just using you for... What the hell? Colonel, are you listening? Now he's dead too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but... Some kind of poison? Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides, but we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn! Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. 
It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? It's a vertex, anyways. No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. Who does Campbell's voice? Because he sounds awesome. Yeah, more life. Wait, does the bar, wait, does the bar actually grow? Suck on bullet. That's right, suck on. That's exactly how you say it. Okay, let's put that away. I don't have any C4 to blow up this door now. Involves two buttons, so I'm basically holding it out and... Oh! The X button. Cool, good to know, thank you. Oh yeah, safe, right. Snake, you can't use your radar in that area. There's some kind of electronic jamming coming from there. I wonder what it is. Anyway, be careful. Let's say Naomi didn't have a British accent, Mei Ling didn't have a Chinese accent. Really? So, so you're telling me that they made like a remake, but they actually changed be stuff? Oops, be careful, Snake. Um, that's weird. Also, it kind of feels good to play a game that has voice acting instead of uh, me bumbling around trying to read stuff to you guys. Oh, there's dudes out here now. Did everything respawn? Dead. Can I get more C4 and go check that area? What? Oh! Should've known. I'm out. Fuck. I should've known. It's following radius, radius. I don't know, Shanghai. I think I'm doing okay. I think. Oh, God, oh, God. The button, the button, the button, the button. Oh, <laughs> I keep punching it. Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake? Damn. Weird. Alright, so we know. We get a grenade from here. Get something from here.
The elevator will work if there's an alert. Okay, good to know. I think there was a room in B1 that I could now, can now access. Was it this one? Is that naked guy still here? Oh, naked guy's gone. Can I go under the bed? Yeah, dog. Alright. Took care of the monsters. Do you have anything under his bed? Nudie mags? <gasps> Russian, Russian. I'm getting a lot of SOCOM bullets. Alright, so let's go back up. The elevator then I guess we can go upstairs or one of those doors in that top floor is gonna do something I'm guessing cranky con <laughs> seems pretty rad though I like this hopefully hopefully I'm not doing too terrible for you guys I, I understand that a game like this is probably really hard to- oh, there's no truck here anymore. A game like this is probably hard to watch for somebody who already knows everything. So I, I hopefully this isn't- What is he doing? You shut up! No, you shut up! No! No, you shut up! You shut up too! Please! Oh god, now you need to shut that fuck up again. Let's get out of here! Okay, so what what what's the button to choke out? I realized Square grabbed him. Do I have to keep holding Square, or like, do I have to hit Circle? Because I hit Circle, and then it seemed like he dropped him. Ah, uh, just because my gun's loud, so I didn't want to I didn't want to gun him down. I know there's a door at the top right that we could probably go check out. Wait, can we check this door out? Cardboard box. Is that the cardboard box? Oh, do I need the actual key? Did I actually pick up a suppressor? When did that happen? I do have a suppressor on it. Oh shit! Shut up! Shut up! Oh god, shut up! No, that's not it! They know! 
Whoa! Oh, I didn't have a ration equip. Mash square after grabbing him? Okay. Alright. Alright. I'm getting the hang of this. I'm doing horrible, yes, but getting the hang of this. Alright, booty. It's good to know. <laughs> getting banged in that closet. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, fuck. Eh. Ah, oh, shitting. Fuck. There's no way to walk, is there? Oh! Why is he shooting? Uh. Uh. Oh. Uh. Uh, I realized I'm not supposed to be playing it this way, oh well. Oh! I didn't have the ration to go to the game. God damn it. I think sh the shish is is a good is is a good weapon to have. That was a weird squeaking animal sound that I didn't like. All right, I realize what must be done. Oh, there's a thing I could. Oh, let's see later. Is there like an upwards part I can get to, or no? Uh, yeah, we took out Revolver Ocelot or something. This is still really loud, huh? Oh, they know? Oh, they know! Oh, you see that duck? Get wrecked! Get up! Oh, God. Yep, that sounds like a good tip. Super sad, Cooper. Alright, we got another ration. A mine detector. Wait, am I even supposed to be up here?
the okay. DARPA chief and President Baker. So now the terrorists know both detonation codes. Hmm. Yeah, and on top of that, they both died right in front of my eyes. Snake, now that the terrorists have both detonation codes, the only way to stop a nuclear launch is to either use the detonation code release keys that Merrill's holding, or... Or find the Metal Gear chief engineer that President Baker mentioned, Hal Emmerich. In any case, you should contact Merrill by codec. Wasn't her frequency... Oh, right, we have to do that. CD case? Okay. Is there like a, a document? Uh, yes. One four zero oh, one five. Is that it down there? Oh, what's the son of a bitch doing? with the way you busted yourself out of there. The one from the prison? You're the colonel's niece, Meryl, right? No, it's not him. Just exactly who are you? I gotta blow my nose real quick. The Germans Germans sent all alone into the middle of this whole mess. You came by yourself? You think you're some kind of one-man army? I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? We go way back. What's your name? My name's not important. Aha. Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? That's what some I did people call me. The legendary Solid Snake? You? Sorry oh, animation. Before. I wasn't sure if you were one of the good guys. But I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes? They're not soldiers' eyes. And they're rookies' eyes, right? No. They're beautiful, compassionate eyes. Oh, just what I'd expect from the legendary Solid Snake. You trying to sweep me off my feet? Don't worry. You'll land back on them once you meet me. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. Oh, I don't believe so that. So the Metal Solid 1 and 2 on Ness or whatever. Why did you look so surprised those... when you saw my face? Those have story at all? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah. You know him? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. So what's the deal, then? Who knows? Why don't you ask him? But first, I want some information. We were involved <laughs> nice in this exercise from the beginning. What exactly happened here? I'm sorry. I was captured along with President Baker right after the terrorist attack. That's okay. But what is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapons disposal facility. Boy, oh boy, it's just like them. Nobody told you anything, did they? Okay. You see, this place isn't really for disposing nuclear weapons. This base is owned and operated by a dummy corporation of Arms Tech. This is a civilian base? Right. For the development of they Metal wow, Gear. Okay. Colonel. Foxhound and the Next Generation Special Forces were called here for the test launching of a dummy nuclear warhead. Why Foxhound? Because they're a special ops group used to handling top secret missions. They figured they could help keep it all hush hush. But we must have fired nuclear warheads before. Why just this time? I heard it was because this was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. Well, that's what I heard, anyway. Uh, sounds kind of fishy. Okay. So cool. what do you think the terrorists want? Mm, sorry. I'm not sure. I was captured with President Baker right after the revolt started. Oh, yeah. That's when he gave you the detonation code override keys, right? That's right. Amazing you were able to keep him hidden from the guards. Well, women have more hiding places than men. Anyway, but China. Baker, huh? How's he holding up? He's dead. What? Heart attack. Same as the DARPA chief. The chief died from a heart attack too? Yeah. Was either of them sick or anything? No, not that I heard of. Well, I don't believe in coincidences. Something funny's going on. Hmm. Sounds like it, but I have no idea what. Me neither. Yet. Do you know the person who designed Metal Gear? You mean Dr. Emmerich? Yes. Is he still alive? Probably. He should be in the research lab in the second floor basement of the nuclear warhead storage building to the north. Second floor basement? Yeah, that's where his lab is. 
I think they're forcing him to work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we'd better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. You plan to take that thing on by yourself, Snake? I got this won't bitch. Be the first time. Ah. Oh. What's the best way to get to the building where the doctor is being held? There's a cargo door on the first floor of this building that leads to the north. What's the security <laughs> level of the door there? Five. But it's okay. I've got a level five card. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go. I'm going with you. No way. You're still too green. I want you to hide somewhere. I'm not green. Oh, yes, you are. Well, she is right now. Pause <laughs> for just one second in front of your enemy and it's all over. Good luck doesn't last forever. I don't know what happened. I just couldn't pull the trigger right away. I never had any problems in training. But when I thought about my bullets tearing through those soldiers' bodies, I, I hesitated. Shooting at targets and shooting at living, breathing people are different. Ever since I was a little girl, I always dreamed about being a soldier. Every day of my life, I've trained my mind and body for the one day when I could finally see some real action. And now... So what now? You want to quit? I can't quit. I can't allow myself to quit now. Listen, Meryl. Everybody feels sick the first time they kill someone. Unfortunately, killing is one of those things that gets easier the more you do it. In a war, all of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits come out. It's easy to forget what a sin is in the middle of a battlefield. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. <laughs> <laughs> You're a real bastard. Just like my uncle said. Huh. I told you. The real me is no match for the legend. <laughs> it looks like you were right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Snake. I'll be a good girl. We'll link up after I grab the doctor. Then we'll take care of the detonation code override. Gotcha. But listen, I know Good this area out. better than you. <laughs> Call me if you have any questions. Be careful, okay? After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Now watch out with dropping spoilers and stuff in this game, you guys. I honestly know nothing about the story of any of these things, so if you guys could keep me clear, or keep clear of all that stuff, that'd be super awesome. Oh, are you serious? Shit, get inside so I can. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, this is going horribly. Oh shit, I don't... Oh, don't do that. Alright, let's just call Meryl from here. I don't think we need anything from up top other than maybe the box. What? Oh, that's not what to do. Shut up! Ah, shut up, circle! something that sounds.
Alright, sweet. Now all we got it all I want to do is get up top so I can take that cardboard box. I think the mine uh, maybe the mine detector. Actually, you know what? It might be worth trying to get the mine detector as well. So we're gonna have to maybe PPU a few dudes. I know, I know. PPU in this game made so good good, but sometimes it's a necessity. Pulling triangle? What's triangle do? Oh, it's horrible. Why? Why triangle? Oh wait, I need to go through that door. Let's go through that door first. Go the cardboard box. Oh, triangle when I'm talking to people. Does it skip everything? for long with the way you walk. What does that mean? Uh, nothing. Listen, Snake, the cargo door is like an airlock. It's equipped with infrared sensors. Be careful. If an intruder is sensed, gas is released. Gas? Okay, so we'll meet at the nuclear warhead storage building. Wait, you said you'd stay put and be a good girl. I changed my mind. Don't get careless. That's when things always turn sour. Sorry. But this is the only way I can figure out whether or not I'm cut out to be a soldier. I gotta get my hands dirty. These guys are professionals. <laughs> You're gonna get yourself killed. See you there. So where's the cargo bay door? Is it up? Do that. Why is there a blinking light here? Soldier's life might be a lonely life. Maybe they do do that. I'm sure they have a reason. Oh shit! <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! Oh god. Going farther. No. No. Keep going farther up. Wanna die, punk? Go up. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna die, punk? Yeah, that's right. Wobbly ass motherfucker. I don't know how much stupid card equipped. Piece of shit. 
Oh, I can be seen! You mother... Oh, shit! We at least called Meryl. So we made a little bit of progress. I have no idea what doors open though. That back. Apparently, these doors open. Be careful, Snake. That airlock is set with infrared sensors. You probably can't see them with your naked eyes, but there are infrared beams coming out of that wall. Touch hmm. any one of them, and the doors will seal off, and the place will be flooded with poison gas. Somehow, you've got to get through without setting off those sensors. Like a pro. Vision goggles? Do I have I have thermal goggles? I don't think I have no vision. Snake, be careful. There are claymore mines around there. Use a mine detector. Who are you? Just call me Deep Throat. <laughs> Deep Throat? The informant from the Watergate scandal? Never mind about that. You're not using burst transmission. Are you nearby? Listen. There's a tank in front of your position, waiting to ambush you. Who are you, anyway? One of your fans. Straight up just says deep throat. Alright. Mei Ling, how can zombie? someone outside of this operation cut into my codec? You're talking about that guy calling himself Deep Throat. We were monitoring from here. What about it? Well, if somebody knows oh, your frequency, they can call you. But the question is, how did he learn it? It's top secret information. Can you tell me where he called from? I'm sorry, the signal is too weak to locate its source. But I'm sure he's near you, somewhere on the base. Wow, you guys. This one. Be careful, Snake. So they're they're already right there. All right, good to good to know. Good to know. Pretty sure I have to fight that though, right? I have to fight that. Snakes don't belong in Alaska. I, I will do. not let you pass. I... Oh. Send him a message. Um... Oh, that backflip. Dude, what about the mines? <laughs> I don't know who that is, but what That's do? That's right. You belong on the ground. You should crawl on the ground like the snake you are. Come, 
Let's fight. Got you, bitch. My nickname is the tank because of my my dick. Okay, uh, I got a grenade. Check this shit out, yo. This didn't work, this didn't work. <laughs> it's not working. Where is he? Juke, 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 juke. Uh. Get fucked. Uh. Get fucked. That's not how you're Apparently, you guys, that's not how you're supposed to do that. I don't, um... Snake, be careful. Mm, oh, no. Oh. No, triangle doesn't skip it. So you're saying I can crawl on these suckers? Oh. If I get the tank to come right down the center, is that gonna blow his ass up? And skip. My claymores are gone! Sneaky snake it up off to the mountain. He won't be able to hit me. Sneaky snake, sneaky snake, sneaky snake. use. <laughs> Thank you. So, is the grenade actually a good thing to be... Oh shit.
wreck, bruh. And I feel like you have no belief in my abilities to uh, do it. Well, boss, I hope you are happy. You got the card. We'll play with him a little longer. You would be wise not to underestimate. Was I supposed to do it that way? What did you think of him? He is just as you said. In what? battle, he is as if possessed by a demon, much like you. I would expect no less. See, this is a random eagle sound when this guy talk. But I will kill Hey, Super Sack Cooper. So, General Ivan, uh, you're awesome. I hear he took your hand as well as oh, your Raven, dignity. Watch your tongue, shaman. In the language of the Sioux people, Sioux means snake. It is known as an animal to be feared. Well, snake is mine now. When I meet him next, I'll take special care of him. Not yet. Don't kill him yet. Oh, okay. He and I will meet again in battle. Same prediction as always. Yes. The, marbles. the raven on my head. It thirsts for his blood. I feel like this guy is gonna be a burden. Let's put him to. Sh I've always wanted to use the bird joke properly. Ooh, more health. My bar grow more? No, it didn't. I just healed. Okay. What's up here? Yeah, rush it. Oh, I can carry three now. I am so good. Thank you. Love three. Was there a door up here? Did you grow more? Okay. How do you open the door? Is that, is that the button? Mr. Versa? Oh. I couldn't tell. It was like pixels in, in the other Careful. pixels. You absolutely must not use weapons in that area. Okay. I've already programmed the nanomachine so that he won't be able to, Colonel. Oh. What? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten? That's where they keep the nuclear warheads. Can't you see them? Yeah, there's lots of boxes piled up here, but are they all warheads? Yes, they're all dismantled warheads. They just leave them here? It's like President Baker said, totally careless. They're working on a limited budget. They try to put on a pretty face for the media, but this is the grim reality of it. Nastasha knows lots more about it than I do. Her frequency is 141.52. All of the warheads in those boxes have had their detonation mechanisms removed, so there's no fear of them exploding. But if the warheads are broken, they might leak plutonium, and that would be a serious problem. Snake, never use your weapon on that floor. So what you're saying... Damn, I don't have any grenades. I think I'm about to get seen.
I'm gonna try to, Mr. Rissa. Definitely gonna try to. Oh, fuck sandwich. There's a guy up top. Oh, there's a guy down below. I think they're actually in the HD collection, so maybe I could try them, but, uh... What is one who... What does she... What? What does she do, though? Also, what is this place? Why does it have brown walls? What? Did it work? It didn't work! It didn't work! How do you... How do you? Shit, there's another one. God damn it. I should have done this. Go down the blaze of glory. It's okay, I won't make this count. Oh, I fucked it up. So, am I supposed to hold square and tap circle at the same time? Because I let go of square when she started choking, or when I started choking him, and then I started mashing circle. But that didn't work because he just let her go, or let that person go. So, or do I have to keep mashing square? Let's just find out how to choke people. There's a little blur near his penis. Okay. Mashing square doesn't do anything either. I want to see if we can figure out how to do it, because it's really fucked up, and we're going to need it at some point, I'm pretty sure. Oh. I thought you said mash circle earlier. Okay. I've, I've been trying mashing square again, but I just tried to mash square. Let's just try it. So... I hold it, and when the second... Also, no full cap skin, goddammit. Okay, so it's instantly. Oh my god, okay, I can't even hold it. Alright, cool. Why did you come in a box? Okay. Alright, awesome. So I have to instantly, like, just push it, then just start fucking go ape shit on my square button. I got you. <laughs> Goddamn chest high walls. TV show from the 90s? Why would why would Snake have DVDs of that? Oh, it's a missile launcher. I was wrong. 
see the square, see if you see. That's me. Why is that one locked? Is it the chick one? Is that why? There's no chicks here? Oh shit! Why do they always know? If I was concussed, I wouldn't- I wouldn't remember where someone ran off to, like... Are they, is he dead? Oh my god! So how do I... I guess I don't need to be here yet. Other than possibly for that launcher. Try my name again? Okay, right. Snake, watch out. That place is filled with gas. Also, the floor is electrified. First, destroy the high voltage switch. It's the switchboard on the northwest wall. But how? I can't reach it. Use a remote controlled missile. I have to use the Nikita? Are you serious? Oh god, my O2's dying. Okay. Okay. Maybe I should save. Why can't Meryl's name be Meryl Deep Throat? Also, Dracula still doesn't work. Save. And oh. Okay, so I got the guild name at least. And my character name has been taken. There we go. Oh, there we go. It's 59 hour 59 minutes before I can't do it anymore. Snake, listen to what Lo G said. He who knows that enough is enough will always have enough. Just because you see an item doesn't mean that you always have to get it. If you don't really need it, think twice before you stick your neck out. It might not be worth it. I'm gonna get enough of that ass. Okay, um, not say that ever again. All right, let's go back in and let's fire this son of a bitch. Uh, so do I just kind of? Oh! Oh! What? How do you? How do you slow it down? Okay. Oh, you piss! Oh, I actually need some oxygen. Eh. Eh.
Sure. Oh. What? Huh? Huh? Oh. 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 oh what the? There's a fucking. Uh. All right. Oh, okay. Awesome. Gotta be like Sanic, Sanic Missile. Oh, it's a machine gun turret. I didn't realize it. Is that a machine gun turret? Hal's lab. Nailed it. Oh, jamming? Cause I'm jam Why did it sound like people drinking tubes? How about a sweet jam session with records. Is this Resident Evil shit? It looks like they were cut by some type of blade. Oh, okay, never mind, Ninja. Kind of still wiggling. Can you talk to people? Snake tails D. What's that? But good to know. Good to know. My finger's actually starting to hurt from using the D pad, so I might use the analog stick for a while. What? You pissed himself? Stealth camouflage? Who are you? Where is my friend? What? What are you talking about? Oh, what next? Snake. You're that ninja. I've been waiting for you, Snake. Who are you? Neither enemy nor friend. I am back from a world where such words are meaningless. I've removed all obstacles. Now you and I will battle to the death. Do we have to? What do you want? I've waited a long time for this day. Now I want to enjoy the moment. What's with these guys? It's like one of my Japanese animes. I've come from another world. To do battle what? with you. What is it? Revenge? It is nothing so trivial as revenge. A fight to the death with you. Only in that can my soul find respect. I will kill you, or you will kill me. It makes no difference. 
fence. No! At least he can find some ah, peace fine. of mind. He can watch from inside there. I need that man. Keep your hands off him. <coughs> now, make me feel it. Oh, yeah, make I'll make you feel it. Feel alive yeah, again. I'll make you feel like a real cyborg. You about to get chuffed. Oh, shit. I don't think I need that. Chuffed. Chuff. That doesn't do anything. What? Did I restrain him or like? you can't defeat me with a weapon like that. Good. Now we can fight this warrior. You can't defeat me with a weapon like that. That was a good punch. Boop. Boop. Oh. Boop. 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 Oh, I missed him. Boop. Oh. Oh. Oh, you punched that. Boop. Oh, no. Boop. Oh no. Boop. 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 Oh, fuck me. I'm not, uh, is this actually what I have to do? Boop. The south bar is going uh, down really slowly. Boop. Oh, okay. Boop. Oh, shit. Can I actually use a chafe chat grenade and then punch the shit out of his ass? Go too good. So what's going on in here? Is this ration? Ration. Oh, well, perfect timing. Okay, well now there's no more windows. I hit him more than once. Oh, okay, now I can hit him more than once. Okay, you're right. I didn't realize you could do a three hit combo. Okay, okay. Must be not in the corner over there. Uh oh. Boop. 
bitch. Hurry up and catch me. I'll catch you. Oh, you ninja. Yep, here again. Get kicked. Hurry up and catch me. Oh, you dirty slut. Get messed up, Minda. Motherfuckers, aren't you? Get chaffed, bitch! I'm gonna end you, son! Oh, I need to do it again. Uh oh, I don't have any more chaff grenades. I have no life. Oh, I tried to dodge his kick! Step on my face, friend. Alright, worth a try. Alright, well, we'll be able to do a lot better now that I know that I can punch three dudes. I th punch them three times, this dude, instead of, um... Instead of, yeah. Now, make me feel it. Make, make me feel alive. Yeah, take it all, you dirty ninja. I'm gonna give it to you, you're gonna feel it, you're gonna take it. Oh, get punched, friend. I'd rather do to you, man. Fistia. Fistia and foot ya. Put my gun away. No need for that shit. Punch your friend. Oh, got flips and shit. Who oh, you fooling, friend? Yeah, you punched. Oh, no, you didn't. Ah, oh, you flips and shit. I feel like there's a chance this game used to be super frustrating. I feel like that's maybe a possibility. That's good, Snake. Use my thermal. Alright. That's a good idea.
Um, that means I have to get rid of my rations. I don't like that. Get wrecked, Ninja Man. Get wrecked, friend. Oh, I missed the kick. Run at me, bro. Oh, get punched. Like old times. Yeah. I've been waiting for this pain. Take the pain. Feel the pain. Give the pain. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Boom. Direct dog. We're supposed to get in chaffed, bruh. Oh. Give you all of my fists. Oh, you missed that punch. It's over. That's it. I remember that punch. Yeah, take it. Oh, I fully remember that your punch was misses. Do you remember, Snake? The feel of battle. The clash sheet of bone and sinew. That's good snake. Wanna finish him off with a super, super, super triple punch. Check this out. And charge it up. Oh, it needs one more of those. Nope. Get chaff, bruh! Zanzibar. What? Not again. What's happening? Gray Fox. No doubt about it. Gray Fox. Ridiculous. This you is what Gray Fox people is should from? know he died in Zanzibar. Is that what you guys no. are talking about? He should have died, but he didn't. What? It happened before I joined Foxhound's medical That's staff. That's why a lot of people had the word they named Gray Fox on JTV. They were using a for their gene therapy course. experiments. I never heard that. It happened right after you retired. My predecessor, Dr. Clark, was in charge. Dr. Clark? Yes. He started the gene therapy project. <laughs> and where is he now? <laughs> nice McSazzle. He was killed in an explosion in his lab two years ago. So what about this soldier? Apparently, for their test subject, they decided to use the body of a soldier who was recovered after the fall of Zanzibar. And that was Grey Fox. But he was already dead. Yes. But they revived him. 
They fitted him with a prototype exoskeleton and kept him drugged for four years while they experimented on him like a plaything. Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I ever heard. They used him to test all sorts of gene therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. Is that the only reason? Naomi, what happened to Grey Fox after that? The record says he died in the explosion. I see. But even if that ninja is Grey Fox, the question <laughs> is, why? From what I could tell, he didn't know who he was. Are you saying that he's just a mindless robot? I'm not sure, but he seems intent on fighting me to the death. We'll meet again. I know it. So you'll fight again? Until you kill him? Huh. I'd rather not. But maybe that's what he wants. Hmm. How long are you gonna stay in there? Huh? Are you one of them? No, I'm not. I always work alone. Alone? Are you an otaku too? Come on, get out. We can't stay here forever. Was that? Your uniform is different than theirs. You're the Metal Gear chief engineer, Hal Emmerich, right? You know me? I heard about you from Merrill. Oh, so you're here to rescue me. Sorry, but no. There's something that I've got to do first. Oh. Was well, Hal Emmerich not one of them? Huh. Are you hurt? Oh, I'm okay. I just twisted my ankle a little bit trying to get away. Well, if that's all, it's nothing to worry about. I want to ask you something. I need information about Metal Gear. Huh? Metal Gear? Yeah. What's Metal Gear really designed for? It's a mobile TMD. It's designed to shoot down nuclear missiles. Only for defensive purposes, of course. Fire! I already know that Metal up, so Gear is nothing but a nuclear-equipped walking deathmobile. Nuclear? What are you talking about? The terrorists are planning to use Metal Gear to launch a nuclear missile. You telling me you didn't know? They're gonna put a dismantled warhead into Metal Gear's TMD missile module? Wrong. From the beginning, the purpose of this exercise was to test Metal Gear's nuclear launch capability using a dummy nuclear warhead. The terrorists are just continuing the work you started. No, you're wrong. I heard it directly from your boss, Baker. No. A nuclear missile on Rex? So you really didn't know? No. All the armament was built by a separate department, and the president personally supervised the final assembly of the main hmm. unit. President Baker? Yeah. I was never told exactly what they armed Rex with. I, I only know it's equipped with a Vulcan cannon, a laser, and a railgun. For an old school game, this thing is pretty fucking crazy on story. Like, in a really a awesome way. Gun, you said. Yeah. It uses magnets to fire bullets at extremely high velocities. The technology was originally developed for the SDI system and, and later scrapped. We were successful in miniaturizing it in a joint venture between Arms Tech and Rivermore National Labs. The railgun is on Rex's right arm. Metal Gear's main function is to launch nuclear missiles. You sure you're not forgetting something? It's true that Metal Gear has a missile module on his back that can carry up to eight missiles, but are you saying it was originally meant to carry nuclear missiles? Metal Gear 2, like the NES game, or? Yeah, Metal Gear Solid 2. but that's not all, I think. If Metal Gear fired only standard nuclear missiles, then they should already have all the practical data they need. No. Could it be? Metal Gear's co-developer, Rivermore National Labs, was working on a new type of nuclear weapon. They were using wow. Nova and NIF laser nuclear fusion testing equipment and supercomputers. So they developed a new type of nuclear weapon in a VR testing lab, huh? Yes, but you can't use virtual data on a battlefield. They would need actual launch data. 
These are some of the supercomputers. If you link these, you can test everything in a virtual environment. But it's all just theoretical. <clears throat> so this exercise was designed to test the real thing. Hmm. What did our president do? If the terrorists launched that thing... <sighs> Damn. Damn. I'm such a fool. It's all my fault. The truth is, my grandfather was part of the Manhattan Project. He suffered with the guilt for the rest of his life. And my father, he was born on August 6th, 1945. The day of the Hiroshima bomb. God's got a sense of humor, all right. Three generations of Emmerich men. We must have the curse of nuclear weapons written into our DNA. Hmm. I used to think that I could use science to help mankind. But the one that wound up getting used was me. Using science to help mankind, it's just in the movies. <laughs> That's enough crying. Pull yourself together. Where is Metal Gear? Where on this base are they keeping it? Rex is in the underground maintenance base. Where is that? North of the communications tower, but it's a long way there. The emergency override system for the detonation code is there, too. Yeah, in the maintenance base control room. You'd better hurry. If they were planning a launch from the start, then their ballistic program is probably finished. And since they haven't called for me in a few hours, they must not need me. In other words, they must be ready to launch. Merrill's got the detonation code override keys. We'll link up with her. If we can't override the launch, we'll have to destroy Rex. Is this Metal Gear Solid only all in one, like, is this just this one mission in on Shadow Moses or whatever? Is that it? Well, I'll show it. you the way. On that leg of yours, like you'll just slow me long down. Because... You'll need me if you're gonna destroy Rex. I don't need you. I just need your brain. I created Rex. It's my right, my duty to destroy him. If you get a chance, try to escape. When the coast is clear, I'll contact you by codec. How am I supposed to escape from an island? Uh, okay. So what then? I want you to hide somewhere and keep me informed. You know this place well, don't you? Of course I do. <laughs> and don't worry, I've got this. Whoa. It's the same stealth technology as the ninja. Foxhound was going to use them, but with this I'll be fine. Bad leg and all. Good. But I want Meryl to watch after you, too. Meryl, the engineer's okay. That's a relief. I want you to look after him. Where are you now? Very close. There she is! <laughs> Over there! <gasps> oh no! Damn, they've spotted me! <laughs> Meryl, what happened? Uh-oh. Something's wrong. Did you hear something? Wasn't that some kind of music? What did she look like? She... she was wearing the same green uniform as the terrorists. A disguise? She had such a cute way of walking. She kind of wiggles her behind. You were really looking. Well, she's got a very cute behind. Way of walking, huh? If she's disguised as the enemy, you'll have to contact her when she's alone, huh? There's only one place where we can be sure she's by herself. Where's that? Don't be so dense. Here, use this security card. It's security level four. Well, he's not gonna die too, is he? You're not in pain, are you? Huh? You feel okay? Nothing bothering you? What's wrong? Getting all friendly all of a sudden. No, nothing. I'm glad you're okay. You're strange. I'm a little nervous. Everyone else I've saved suddenly dies. You're bad luck. Forget it, Doctor. Call me Otacon. Otacon? 
It stands for Otaku Convention. And Otaku's a guy like me who likes Japanimation. Oh, no, is he actually going to explain this? the first country to successfully make bipedal oh. robots. They're still the best in the field of robotics. And Japanese cartoons played some part in that? They did. I didn't get into science to make nuclear weapons, you know. That's what all scientists say. I became a scientist because I wanted to make robots like the ones in the Japanese animes. Really, it's true. Just is that something they created or is this actually from an anime? Was that actually You're from right. some sort of anime? We have to take responsibility. Science has always thrived on war. Greatest weapons of mass destruction were created by scientists who wanted to be famous. But that's all over now. I won't take part in murder anymore. Whatever. All I want from you is information. Sure. I know everything about this whole base. Ask me anything about Rex or about this place. Also, Up with this okay. stealth camouflage, I can sneak nuts. in and out of the armory and mess hall. If you need ammo or rations, just tell me and I'll bring them to you. Really? I'm on frequency 141.12. See you later. Does he have a bum, bum leg? What the fuck? How's he... Okay. Okay. Autocon's pretty awesome. Yay! Okay, one of his older games. So when he said "Don't be so dense," was he saying that she'd be like in the bathroom? Was that is that is that why that one door was locked? Was that literally? Oh my god, I forgot about that thing. I'm gonna edge it. Yep, this is on the PS. Well, this is on PS3, but I'm playing the um, play playing on PS. It's a PS1 game, and I'm playing on the PS3. There you go. Do I have to actually look at butts? Are you serious? So do I have to get close to her and then contact her? Or what do I have to do? Okay, that's totally that one. Isn't it her? What? Oh. It was her. Oh my god. Oh, why am I on the ground? Oh, I just killed her. What's wrong? Snake! Snake! Why should you go hiding? Don't move.
That's the second time I've been able to sneak up on the legendary Solid Snake. You're Meryl? There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. Besides, it's a waste of time. When I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. Same smart mouth. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. What's that mark? Huh? It's oh, like Rainbow this? Dash. <laughs> it's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I was a fan of Foxhound way back, and guys like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either yeah, dead why'd you take your pants or off too? One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Killing. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life, no ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. <clears throat> Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me in disguise? I never forget a lady. So there's something you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. Oh, I see. What? First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. So she is putting pants on, right? <laughs> Good. So Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear or... We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. I, I don't like did. to waste bullets. Got it. I'll be careful. <gasps> Mirrors that you work? Know, I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. PlayStation 1? I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. But I was wrong. It wasn't really my dream. My father. He was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. So are you a soldier yet? I thought I was until today, but now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself, afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not gonna lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't get another chance for a while. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. Yeah. Is that FAMAS functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where'd you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol too, but I chose this. Huh, so I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Don't worry, I can handle it. Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. What's sna what are snake tails? If we're gonna go to the north, we'll have also, to go through the commander's room on this out floor. Out of her socket. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. 
The door to the commander's room is security level 5. This card will open it. It was inside the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. Looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. I wonder... Hold on. Okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. I'll be point man. Follow me. So, you, you guys know how, like, PS1 games and weird stuff? You know how, like, the walls look like they're always shifting and, like, weird stuff? I wonder what it is that causes that. Because I'm pretty sure back then everything was still all, uh, triangles and stuff, right? So is it just that, like, why do they shift so much? I wonder what it is that causes that. That's strange. There's no guard. What happened to the music? I'll keep a lookout. Make sure you're ready, okay? What am I supposed to do? There's nothing in here. Control music. Hmm. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. Snake. Oh, I thought that was just put her out. That's not how you. Everybody, everybody who have done that, Errol. I thought you were choking them. I didn't know you were busting their fucking neck. That was accidental. Oh, Daisy. Hmm. Yeah, that flip thing sounds a little better now. How do you actually flip properly? Is it just square and put away from her, or...? My head! Oh, it... Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting.
snake, Meryl's... Triangle doesn't work. Oh well. Ah, not circles. Circles, go. Actually doing something? Sweet. <laughs> Useless woman. Optic camouflage, huh? I hope that's not your only trick. Oops, I didn't mean to punch that. Sorry, you guys. You, you doubt my power. Now I will show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy in the world. No, there's no need for words, Snake. I'm Psychomantis. That's right. This is no trick. It's true power. Huh. It's useless, I told you. I can read your every thought. Now, let me read your mind. No, perhaps I should say your past. You're a careless man, aren't you? And you're a poor warrior as well. You're a jerk. However, you are skillful at eluding traps. Still don't believe me. Now I'll read more deeply into your soul. I killed three men. Hmm. Your memory is completely clean. Hmm. You have not said it often. You are somewhat reckless. I can read you like an open book. You still don't believe me? I will show you my psychokinetic power. Put your controller on the floor. Put it down as flat as you can. That's good. Now I will move your controller by the power of my will alone. Does he make it vibrate? That's pretty cool. I do have PlayStation 1 saves, though. I think some friends have played Final Fantasy 9 and 7 and stuff. As well as like Silent Hill 1 has been Is this the thing from Metal Gear Awesome? Where he's like, you have to do something with a controller or something? I don't know if I can do this on a PS3 though. I don't know what it was, it was like... Dodge everything you put out. Ow. What do you have to do? You have to like switch the controller or something? That's pretty cool, I won't lie. Oh, paintings! That's a pretty cool thing, I like the other thing. Can I just shoot him? Like, is that a, is that a thing? Do I have to punch everybody? Oh. 
I feel like there's way more boss fights in this game than I thought there would be. Oh, okay, I can't guess so, yeah. I thought he was down below. to give me the Dark side Phil. Okay, I've heard of him. Okay. Yeah. Colonel. Oh, is that the dude who played Metal okay. Solid like super shittily and somebody made like a clip out of it? I owe you one. Now that Mantis is beaten, Meryl's brainwashing should wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's okay. sake, or maybe it's because you like her? I don't want to see any woman die right in front of me. Oh, really? Since when did anybody's death bother you so much? Naomi. It's true that Snake has killed a lot of people, but that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. Alright, I think soon we're gonna give it a stop for tonight. You used the other. I wasn't able to read the future. A strong man doesn't need to read the future, he makes his own. Perhaps so. But I'll read your future. <laughs> to get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. Oh shit, game was You have to go through. No, nah, no, yeah, double demon, sorry. Door. Also, what's up? There's a hidden door behind the bookcase. What's up, Zero? The overland route. It's blocked by frozen glaciers. Go past the communication towers. And use the tower's walkway. 
Why are you telling me this? I can read people's minds. In my lifetime, I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of men and women. Oh, gross. And each mind that I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. It was enough to make me sick. Every living thing on this planet exists to mindlessly pass on their DNA. We're designed that way. And that's why there is war. But you... You are different. You're the same as us. We have no past, no future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Hmm. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world, we're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. Oh, fucked up. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. That's when my future disappeared. I lost my past nice as well. Nice I'm hoping to get into when I came to, the the pretty village cool was so far. In flames. <laughs> like it. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same. I'll be trying to go through all of them all the way up until uh <laughs> zeros. We are truly the same. You and I. Thanks, Double Demon. <laughs> The world is a more interesting place with people like you in it. I never agreed with the boss's revolution. His dreams of world conquest do not interest me. I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. Nice, Kimlism. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. I've seen through evil. You, Snake. You're just like the boss. No, you're worse. Compared to you, I'm not so bad. I read her mind as well. Merrill's? I saw you there. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? Yes, a large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. I have a last request. What is it? My mask. Put it back on. Okay. Like this, other people's thoughts force their way into my mind before I die. I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. <laughs> this story for this PlayStation 1 game is I'll fucking open the door amazing. For you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. This is the first time I've ever used my power to help someone. Kind of nice. Let's go, Meryl. I'm sorry, Meryl. How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? If you're gonna doubt yourself, I'll leave you here. Yeah, that too, Mr. Rizzo. You're right. 
Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. You're right. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Snake, can I ask you something? What? About what Mantis said. I was just wondering. What? What's the problem now? Oh, no, nothing. So, tell me, Snake. What's your name? Your real name? A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. You're a sad, lonely man. Come on. Let's go. Even the music is really awesome in this. <clears throat> nice. Um, oh, sweet. Her health increase, too. Um, so I might actually be ending it here for tonight if you guys are cool with that. Um, just because it is pretty late and I've been casting since 2. So it has been a very, very long day. Um, but for those of you who are wondering, if you're new here, feel free to follow the channel. I do stream every day. I'm trying to go for like 7 hours every day between 2 p.m. and at least 9 p.m. Eastern. But as you guys can tell... Oh, wrong side. It's almost 11, so that I, I just I bust that nine hour uh, that seven hour mark because walk through the door. All right, I'll do that. Um, but before, in case it starts another cutscene, um, yeah, feel free to follow. I'll be trying to go through all the Metal Gear Solids and stuff. Oh, uh, plug controller into port one. Oops. Um, but uh, oops. Yeah, I think I'm actually going to try to go through Metal Gear Solid one, two, three, four, and Ground Zeroes as well as Peace Walker if I can. So. Those sound like pretty sweet games. Oops. It never remembers that it's... Uh, I want it on... Uh, analog. What do we can do some DNT? Um... I'm not exactly sure on that one. I think it's just going to have to be days where we're going to have to just... Figure it out and stuff, but, yeah. So I don't know if I, I should have probably saved first just in case there's a cutscene, but we'll let this cutscene pull out, play out, pull out. Anyway, yeah, so. Could there be wolves in there? Wolf dogs. Half wolf, half husky. What? How do you know so much? I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. Nice. I'll take point. Snake, you follow me. <laughs> nice, Mr. Versa. Alright, so we'll use this time to save here. Man, Metal Gear Solid 1 is goddamn awesome. Hopefully this is actually Snake, okay for you guys to watch. Radar. I know. I can't use it in a narrow space like this, right? Right. I'm sorry. No reason to apologize. Even the greatest masterpiece has its flaws. But, uh... Yeah, hopefully I'm not playing this too badly. Hopefully I'm doing okay, and hopefully... This is pretty awesome, so... Three hours into it. Okay, not bad. Not bad. I think we're doing okay. Mei Ling, how did you get into this line of work? The truth is, I always wanted to become a fighter pilot. I fell in love with jets watching them in the movies. You'd be surprised how many people say the same thing. But I didn't want to kill people. That's when I heard that the U.S. Air Force needed people to do BDAs, battle damage assessments. And those are the guys whose job it is to confirm how successful a bombing run was. Yeah, so I started to do research into aerial photography and air intelligence. I made it my major. But there are no pilots who only do BDAs. That's right. But by the time I learned that, I was already an expert in my field. Hmm. Cool. All right, anyways. Yeah. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be done here for tonight, you guys. Hopefully you all enjoyed yourself. Um, other than that, I don't know if there's like a... Does anybody have a link to, like, a Metal Gear Solid song of some sort that I could play as an outro? Or, like, let's see here. Is this the theme song? Oh, oh it's playing on the wrong thing. Hopefully this will not be too loud. Am 
No, hold on. Maybe you guys got a better song. Sweet Two's got a song. Snake Eater. Okay, even though we're not there yet, sure, might as well. I'm okay with that. So anyways, to everyone, have yourselves a good night. Hopefully I will see you guys tomorrow. We're going to play some more of this for sure. And uh, yeah, so everyone, hope you guys had a good Tuesday. Uh, tomorrow we might also be checking out uh, a new Xbox One game from the people who made Swords and Sorcery called Super Time Force. Apparently it's like Contra and some pretty cool stuff. Um, so for, feel free to tune in for that as well. I'm going to be starting tomorrow again at 2 p.m. Eastern, hopefully around that time. And we'll go as late as we did today. And if I finish Metal Gear Solid 1, we'll jump into 2. Let's do it. Let's have some fun. Anyways, to everyone, have yourselves a good night. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Stay awesome, you guys.